Mai Deshmi, congratulations for winning this award. Thank you. And uh, just a few questions. Uh, what are your thoughts on winning this award and what does this award mean to you? I think A, I'm um, very happy and thankful and honored actually to the jury, to everyone, uh, where I got the opportunity and the platform uh, and the spotlight for all the work that I've done so far. So the award is a testament to the work that I've done so far and it's a motivation for me to do, to work harder and to bring more things on the table for all that that is yet to be explored. Sure. According to you, what are the key trends and innovations that are shaping the marketing industry today? I think the trend is more turning towards um, telling more stories than just selling your products. So it's, Tell, don't sell. I think that's what people are going towards, be it to, via AI or whatever, right? Adaptive, collaboration, partnerships, all of that is happening. But I think the core aspect being telling, not selling. How are brands positioning, according to you, how are brands positioning themselves to embrace advancements such as AI? I think um, brands are getting uh, more proactive and they are brand managers from, I think, sales team, marketing, everyone. They're coming as a team, as one together to explore the full potential of AI, right? Be, be it how to explore AI, even on on-ground offline sales, to ensuring there is a social listening, there is a customer listening tool, everything. I think the brands are ensuring that every department, even customer service for that matter, right? Which is a very customer centric, but even AI is used there. So I think brands are now looking at leveraging AI in every single department that they have so that they can explore the full potential to ensure that, you know, they are going from level A to level Z actually. So yeah. Right, okay. One piece of advice that you would like to share with the upcoming generation? I think I'll share what I follow, which is practice, um, I prioritize rather, prioritize learning and embrace challenges. That's the only way to go, I feel.